compact estate cars that look pretty but can barely carry the weekly shopping home and others that are the size of a barn and not much more stylish. And then there's Mercedes-Benz C-Class Estate. Like any Mercedes, it's the soul of discretion, dignified and elegant, and although it may not be the biggest wagon the company makes, it's still surprisingly practical. You get a boot with best part of 500 litres of space, and that can be almost tripled if you fold down those rear seats. It's beautifully trimmed in here too, there's no flimsy carpets or cheap plastics. In fact, it might even put you off putting your muddy riding gear in here. When passengers take priority over cargo, you'll find there's more than enough space for four people to sit in comfort. And the driver's environment is as logical and sensible as you'd expect from a company that's been making cars for over 125 years. It includes a central controller, a little bit like BMW's iDrive system, which can be used to operate many of the car's standard and optional features. Mercedes offers SE, Sport and Elegance versions and it's not just the level of equipment that differs. Sport versions have a firmer suspension and come with a body kit supplied by performance division AMG. They also have a three-pointed start mounted on the grille rather than on the bonnet. The suspension changes make the handling sharper and the ride just a little bit firmer, but all versions of the C-Class Estate tend to err on the side of comfort. There's a range of four, six or eight cylinder petrol or diesel engines and most feature stop-start technology to help bring down CO2 emissions and company car tax. But the badges on the boot aren't really a reliable guide to the engine capacity. All the small petrol engines are 1.8 litre turbos while the diesels are 2.2 litre units. The diesels will appeal to business drivers because they can help reduce monthly tax bills, although they're not the most refined engines around. Standard safety protection, as we've come to expect from Mercedes, is impressive. It even has something that'll tell a tired driver when they need to take a break. And if you really want to push the boat out, there are systems that will prevent you from crossing lanes into the path of an oncoming car. So there you have it, the Mercedes C-Class Estate, a classy and elegant car that puts comfort ahead of excitement. It may not be the cheapest car to run and it may not have the best interior, but what you're getting is a highly practical car that's also highly desirable. <laughs>